Royals, what's going on? It's your girl Q the Queen. Um, hope everybody's week has been treating them very well. It's been a very exhausting one for me, honestly. Um, for those who follow me on IG, you know I was in LA this past weekend and I literally, I went straight back to work <laughs> when I got back in town. So didn't get a chance to really rest up and just uh, recover so to speak so I just been full full steam ahead the whole time all week all week basically but also um, I wanted to go ahead and, and get in front of you guys this week and uh, show you guys what I actually caught from LA again those who follow me on Instagram probably already know what this is but I had to go ahead and share so um, crazy thing though is that you know I, I thought these were sold out you know, sneakers app, uh, local stores, they were gone for the most part. Um, I didn't really have time to really go on a scavenger hunt because I literally I flew out uh, to L.A. from Chicago uh, the day that these released. So there, there really wasn't a whole lot I could do anyway. But anyway, um, of course, going to another city, you definitely want to see what kind of heat you can find, whether it be classics, retros, any, something new, whatever the case might be. But uh, I was able to actually find these. So um, what I have here <clears throat> is, yeah, got the Air Foam Posit 1. And these are particularly, uh, the most recent drop. Kakaya. <laughs> so, you know, I didn't want to create too much mystery or suspense. Wanted to get straight into it. This right here is the epitome of sexy. So, so sexy. I absolutely had to have them when I found out that they were releasing. I'm like, yeah, I think I might have to go ahead and, and bite, you know. When I was talking about the uh, the uh, the royal colorway, I was telling you guys I'm not a huge foam posit fan, but certain ones are just must-haves. Those royals are a must-have. If you don't have anything else, you have to have the royals. But um, these right here, I mean, whew, I love red. Just this point of reference, red is an amazing, amazing, amazing color. <laughs> Um, it's easily my, my top, eh, it's not my number one favorite color. My favorite color is, is turquoise, kind of like those aqua greenish, aqua bluish, sort of, uh, that family of colors. But red is definitely a close second in terms of, uh, my most favorite colors. So, we got here, foam posit, metallic red, um, as you know, obviously, Red foam, um, carbon fiber, uh, got that new book surrounded by that white swoosh. I know some folks prefer the uh, the Foam Posit Pro, but I'm, I'm definitely partial to the Foam Posit 1. Uh, it has, of course, that penny logo. You got to have that. Um, I love, I love, love, love the, uh, the penny logo and the Foam Posit 1, so... Um, with the outsole, of course, you see, you got those icy bottoms, got the red pot coming in the middle of there, more carbon fiber, that white penny, bordered in black, um, got that good tongue action, more of that penny, <laughs> that logo is classic, man, I mean, if you, if you like classic things, this, this is no exception. It just is not. Red stripes on the pool tab goes all the way down there into the bridge of the shoe. And then you saw the back pool tab as well is, is much of the same. So nothing too crazy. Um, insole, got that white Nike Air and then the black sock liner and everything. So we've all seen foams. It's nothing too crazy to really talk about too much. But this colorway is just is bananas. It's bananas. I don't know if people aren't really talking about them because they're all gone. Um, were they limited? I mean, I know they sold out super quick. So did people just decide they didn't want to be up on these? What was, what was the case in terms of, of the talk? 
wasn't a whole lot of hype around them but i mean they're they're hype themselves if you ask me <laughs> if you ask me these are hype on their own so i guess you really don't have to really don't have to talk a whole lot about them so even though foams are on the slower end these days so um but yeah the story about these i actually was in la i walked around you know fairfax and melrose that whole area is just is boutiques and shops all over the place um and then i actually when i went to mag park uh which for those who are really into youtube you've probably seen a lot of folks vlog about mag park and um i was talking to some of the guys in there and they told me it was a bait store around and i am a fan of, of bait me uh, baitme.com i usually shop online of course because we don't have a bait in chicago so um all right so as i was saying <laughs> um went over to uh to the bait store with the referral of the mag park guys and um you know stepped in there beautiful layout um they had a lot of display items and stuff go check out my last video it's actually the vlog from la so you actually kind of see a little bit of a few of those stores that i went to on fairfax uh, most of the stores are on fairfax uh flight club map park um undefeated was in a different area but um bait was on melrose so right across fairfax that intersection um bape they had a bape store too but i'm not really a bape fan like that so i didn't really show footage in there but anyway went to the store and um they had these on display and they had the metallic gold 97s now being that i already have them i did not ask um if they you know what sizes they may have had left but all i know they might have had my size left so who knows but when i saw these i was like y'all still got these or is this just a joke and then we're like, yeah, we're like, if you have a size eight, we can talk. <laughs> he brought that size eight boy. I put them on the feet. You know, I knew they would fit or whatever. And I knew they were mine. So it wasn't really anything to to um to debate there because I, I knew that I wanted them. So this is definitely a good come away. Um, this is the bag. Kind of kept it with me for a second until I was able to show you guys. And then this other side. Kind of see superior bait right here. Um, oh, this also, this other side kind of shows their, uh, if you can see it, their social media. I think it's like Instagram, Twitter. Um, I think I see YouTube on there too. So what is it? YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. So hashtags, if you guys don't know bait me. If you guys remember that, um, that uh, Diodora Skeletor, vid i did way back when <laughs> it wasn't that long ago i'm still new to this um one of my first videos that I, I go back and i look at those sorts of things and i'm like yeah i can do better but anyway i did a video on that shoe and um i got it from bait so definitely a good track record with that with that store um i'm looking forward to you know future cops from them absolutely so metallic red foams didn't want to take up a ton of time royals just wanted to show you guys what i caught from la you will see me again very soon i have some things coming in the in the, in the works in terms of uh, more content to get out to you um hopefully within the next couple of days so without further ado thank you guys for supporting the queen uh is you you're so kind you're so kind <laughs> royalty